Good morning, guys. Good morning. I am so grateful to be up on this morning on Commanding Our Morning, Day 78. I pray that your mind is set and ready for the nuggets and mysteries and secrets that God has for us on today. I pray that you're ready to accept your kingdom assignment for today in the name of Jesus. So our thought for today, day 78, is God's promises are for you. God's promises are for you. Thus says the Lord God to these bones, surely I will cause breath to enter into you and you shall live I will put hallelujah swans on you and bring flesh upon you cover you with skin and put breath in you and you shall live then you shall know that I am the Lord glory to your name God that's Ezekiel 37 and 5. So we're going to go to Ezekiel 37 and 5, okay? Glory to your name, God. In Ezekiel 37 and 5 says, Thus says the Lord God to these bones, Surely I will cause breath to enter into you and you shall live. Hallelujah. I will put, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, sooners on you and bring flesh upon you, cover you with skin and put breath in you, and you shall live. Then you shall know that I am the Lord. So I prophesied as I was commanded and as I prophesied there was a noise and suddenly it rattling hallelujah and the bones came together bone to bone indeed as I looked the suits and the flesh came upon them hallelujah and the skin covered them over but there was no breath in them. Also he said to me, prophesy to the breath, prophesy son of man, and say to the breath, hallelujah, thus says the Lord God, come from the four winds, O breath, and breathe on these slain, hallelujah, that they may live. So I prophesied and he commanded me, and breath came into them, and they lived and stood upon their feet. Hallelujah, an exceedingly great army. Hallelujah. Then he said to me, Son of man, these bones are the whole house of Israel. They indeed say, Hallelujah, our bones are dry. Our hope is lost. Hallelujah. And we ourselves are cut off. Hallelujah. Therefore prophesy and say to them, Thus says the Lord God, Behold my people, I will open your graves, hallelujah, and cause you to come up from your graves, hallelujah, and bring you into the land of Israel. Then you shall know that I am the Lord when I have opened your graves, O my people, and bought you up from your graves, hallelujah, I will put my spirit in you, hallelujah, and you shall live, and hallelujah, I will place you in your own land, then you shall know that the Lord has spoken it and perform it, says the Lord. Glory to your name, God. Now, hallelujah, I don't know how many of you out here or how many of us out here that our bones are dry and they've been dead for a long time. God said he has put breath in them. He has uh, covered them with skin, hallelujah, and he has commanded and prophesied it to live. So these bones have to get up out of that grave, hallelujah, of that seat of do nothing, of that seat of failure, of doubt, or I can't make it, and live. 
in the name of Jesus. These bones must go and move and manifest and do what the word of God says. It must be performed. God has spoken. His word will not come back void. It will accomplish what it has been sent to do. So bones get up and live in the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. Just know, hallelujah, God makes no mistakes. He knows, hallelujah. He sees the beginning. He sees the ending. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. It's up to us. What do we believe? Hallelujah. Do you believe the word of the Lord? Will you walk it out? Will you accept it? Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Let's go a little further on in today. Hallelujah. Commanding our day 78. Commanding our morning. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. When you read the Bible, hallelujah, you need to take God's word personally. Hallelujah. His promises are for his people. And if you have given your life to him as your Lord and Savior, hallelujah, glory to God. We had a segment on that one, y'all. Get it and confess it and do what it says. His word will not come back void. Hallelujah. It will accomplish what it's sent to do. His word, his His uh, commandments, his statutes is a complete work. It's already finished. It's already completed. We must walk it out and manifest it here in the earth in the name of Jesus. Then that means you speak life unto your dead areas in your life. Command those bones to get up and live. Do what God's word say. Confess God's word and act it out in the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. You'll be amazed at what God's word in your mouth will do for you. If God has said it, then that should settle it for us in the name of Jesus. Because he don't make no mistakes. We don't need to double back. I had a segment on that one. We don't need to double back. Hallelujah. If God said it, that settled it. It is done. It is finished. It's complete. It's a finished work in Jesus' name. And we just need to learn to say yes and obey and be obedient to the word of God in the name of Jesus. Now let's go on into prayer for today. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. Father God, through, though you, through you, I can do all things. Father through you, I can do all things. Hallelujah. Let me be more aware of your presence and power in my life today. I will proclaim your word. I decree and declare that my environment is hallelujah, purposely. Hallelujah. My family is blessed. Hallelujah. My environment is prosperous. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. Glory to your name. Hallelujah. And my family is blessed. Hallelujah. And all my needs are supplied according to your riches in glory. In the name of Jesus, let joy, peace, prosperity, and success be as, hallelujah, abundant in my life as the stars. Your blessings, hallelujah, Lord, Make me rich and everything I need to fulfill my destiny will be at my disposal. Hallelujah. When I need it, in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. We have to believe that God, when he comes, he come whole. There's nothing missing, nothing broken. There's nothing that you would need. Hallelujah. Everything will be accessible to bring our destiny. Hallelujah. To, to the forefront, and it will manifest in our lives. We just need to stay with God, stick with God, pronounce His Word, do the will that He has performed and created for us to do in this day, in our lives, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Make sure that we are one of His. Hallelujah. We have confessed Him as Lord and Savior. Hallelujah. Living according to His Word. Hallelujah. Confessing His Word, living His Word. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus and everything else. Hallelujah. Glory 
glory to your name, we'll line up with the word of God. Hallelujah. We just have to speak it, act it, and perform it in the name of Jesus. Stay connected to him. Hear what he says. Walk it out, hallelujah, that it may be manifested through us in Jesus' name. Father, I thank you right now, hallelujah, that we'll be obedient to your word. Hallelujah, that we'll keep our spiritual ears open. Hallelujah, and our spiritual eyes open. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, that we'll speak, hallelujah, your word of God. That, that your word, that we will speak it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. That we'll walk up right. Hallelujah. That we can be able to hear one day, well done, my good and faithful servant. Hallelujah. That we'll do all that we know in this human body, in this flesh, to do your will, your statutes, hallelujah, and your commandments, that we'll keep them in the forefront of our, our lives, and we'll keep you forever first in everything that we do say and react in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you for helping us. I thank you for equipping us. I thank you for protecting us. I thank you for the, your blood covering us. I thank you for making your blood a boundary, hallelujah, between us and the world and sin, and hallelujah, condemnation and uh, hallelujah in the name of Jesus God I thank you in the mighty name of Jesus that you have your way in our lives hallelujah that you keep our kids our spouses our grandchildren hallelujah that you will give us favor with you and favor with man hallelujah we thank you right now for providing everything that we ever need because you are our provider you are our source in Jesus name and we receive it hallelujah glory to God amen hallelujah guys y'all have a blessed day no God love you no I love you. Until our next segment, y'all have a blessed day. And i see you on our next one if God says so. And I know that he will, not unless he's ready to take me on. And if so, I want to have my life so in line with him that if he does decide to do that, I'm okay. And I pray in the name of Jesus that you feel the same way and that you confess the same. In Jesus' name, amen.